Hello again, everyone. It's Desiree Nielsen, registered dietitian, and we are here today to talk about immune health and your gut. Now, if you're wondering how in the heck your gut can have anything to do with your immune system, here's a little important fact for you. Roughly 70% of your immune activity exists within and along your gut. How is this even possible? Something you have to understand about your gut is that your immune system is there to protect you against the threats of the outside world. And we don't normally think of our gut as the outside world because it's literally protected by our body. But in reality, from the entrance on through the exit, your gut is continuous with the outside world. So it's a really important barrier between you and the outside world, just like your skin is. And so in all of its wisdom, your body places a lot of its immune arsenal around your gut and it becomes a critical barrier that needs to be intact, healthy, and thriving to help keep your immune system at ease. And the immune system is really important when we think about their gut bacteria too, because your immune system, which is there to defend you against all sorts of germs, is in very close proximity to, oh, I don't know, like trillions of gut bacteria. So how does that even work? Your gut bacteria are constantly communicating with your immune system. The immune system and the gut itself helps shape and control the community of gut bacteria. And likewise, beneficial microbes living in your gut are also talking to your gut and interacting with your gut and your immune system to say, hey, we're okay, everything is on the up and up. So how do these bacteria actually support and defend and communicate with your immune system? So it is thought that a healthy community of gut bacteria helps you to resist infection from potentially less healthy or more harmful gut bacteria. Think about it. Every organism that exists uh, is there to help defend and protect its survival. And so just by being there, taking up space, competing for space and food and other resources, a big healthy community of gut bacteria are gonna make it more challenging for those ne'er-do-wells to actually get a foothold. What's really interesting here too is that it looks like the presence of a normal healthy community of gut bacteria help to keep that gut barrier super strong and healthy. As an example, there's been research done uh, in an animal model where they've shown that animals that don't have a gut microbiome, they've been raised to be sterile, actually have way thinner gut barriers than the same animals that have a robust and thriving microbiota or community of gut bacteria. What's more, when you feed your gut bacteria all those wonderful plant foods and all of those wonderful fibers, they ferment those fibers and create short chain fatty acids. They're just like they sound, they're fats and they're really tiny, um, but they're not just fats. In fact, your gut cells eat, if you can say they eat, but they use those short chain fatty acids to fuel their metabolism so they stay strong. And those short chain fatty acids are also thought to interact with your immune system to help keep the immune system stay strong. So in theory, probiotics may help to support an immune system. And we see that in the research, uh, for example, um, one very large uh, review called Cochrane Review found that taking probiotics may be associated with less risk of upper respiratory infections, AKA the basic like common cold and flu kind of thing. And so there's a lot of interesting, often more questions than answers, but in theory, probiotics might be a perfect partner to help support your immune system. And so if you're looking for a probiotic for everyday health and wellness, look no further than bio -K. So in Canada, we have two options. There's the mild, which is a 12.5 billion, and then the regular, which is a 25 billion CFU count. And for all of my friends in the US, you have the daily care probiotic. We got 30 and 50 and the 80 billion extra care. So if you have any questions about probiotics, gut health and the immune system, let us know at BioK Plus or reach out to me, Desiree Nielsen RD.